First, let's get over to Krista with that good news. Yeah, a lot to look forward to in this forecast. Looking fantastic for these next several days as temperatures are warming and we're looking at a lot of quiet weather ahead. Quiet out the door this morning. This is the view in Carmel. We aren't seeing any rain or snow coming down, but these temperatures are cold. You will need that jacket as you're heading out the door. Temperatures in those mid and upper 20s at this time. 27 is where we stand in Indianapolis. 29 in Shelbyville and 26 in Kokomo. Really, these temperatures are right where they should be for this time of year, but they're going to go above average as we head into the afternoon. While we should be seeing highs in the mid 40s for today's day, we're actually going to see highs this afternoon in those low 50s, and this is the time of year those average high temperatures rise very quickly. So this afternoon, it'll feel closer to the average high temperature that we typically see on March 20th. That is the first day of spring in the mid 50s. But as we head into the weekend, we're going to see temperatures close to the average high of what we'll see around April 17th. That is Easter. And of course, I'm looking forward to that. average highs in the mid 70s, May 29th. That's what we'll have for the Indy 500. But live guardian radar at this time, we are quiet. Our skies are clear. We have high pressure and control. It's brought us that beautiful weather over the weekend, and it's keeping things quiet for now. So as you're planning out your day, while temperatures are chilly now, by noon, they'll be into those low and mid 40s. Yes, that's still a chill to the air, but that's going to be quite a jump from already where we had started off this morning, and then we'll keep them going, rising into the low 50s at 52 for that high temperature today. We will see a few more clouds around today compared to what we saw yesterday where we had a perfectly clear day, a few clouds, especially into the late afternoon and evening hours, but that's not going to provide any hiccups for our day today. We are still looking at pleasant weather from the afternoon all the way into the evening. So your temperatures this evening, if you are going to be outside, by 10 o'clock we will have cooled off into those lower 40s and we'll see partly cloudy skies overnight, but not as cold. Temperatures tomorrow morning will start off in those mid 30s. So a little bit of a warm up already there. And then we'll see them rise into those mid and upper 50s as we head into tomorrow afternoon. Really the change for tomorrow, warmer temperatures, about five degrees warmer from what we'll see today and we'll have more clouds around, but it's still another dry day. Our next chance for rain comes as we head into Wednesday, but even then we still have a lot of dry time. So by Wednesday morning, we'll pause CBS 4 Future View here at 6 a.m. We'll still see dry conditions, a lot of sunshine into the afternoon with a front coming through. We'll start to see those clouds increasing again, and by the late afternoon, this is 430, we could start seeing a few isolated showers around becoming widely scattered through the evening, but we're talking mainly I-70 and north. So while we're tracking rain chances for Wednesday, most will be on the dry side, and then that moves on out and we finish off the work week dry. Now temperatures do climb to 58 on Wednesday, so that's the warmest of the work week. And then Thursday and Friday, we cool to those mid 40s and right around 50 degrees to close us off for the work week. Looking ahead to the weekend though, looking at possibly the warmest air of the year so far, a high of 66 on Saturday, 64 on Sunday, but we are tracking some rain chances with it. Beth?